Hello viewers, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I will be taking you through a revision on oral skills and we will be considering the various sounds in English, vowel and consonant. Before that viewers, allow me to ask those who are new here to kindly hit onto the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so that anytime we produce a video like this, YouTube will automatically notify you. Again, to my subscribers, thank you very much. Let's now delve deep into our discussion of the day. And uh, the question there is that in the following set of words, identify the underlined speech sound that is odd. So in number one, we have those words there so we can go through them the first word uh, is read as chase second word raise then gaze and lastly miss so if you look at the underlined letters the sound that comes from them is z the z sound while in the last word that is mes, the sound is s. So the odd one out is mes. Roman 2, we have think, then, theater, and thought. So in the three words, think, theater, and thought, we have sound th and this is the symbol for that sound the theta and for then we have this sound here sound th so the odd one out here is then which has the sound of the moving to the third uh, number three, we have the word exhort. Number two, we have exist. And uh, number three, we have exile. And lastly, exhibit. So the letters EX in all words apart from exile is read as eg, eg, eg. Exhort, exist, and exhibit. So we have exile as the odd one out. Question two. Uh, the question reads, cluster words from this list based on the pronunciation of vowel sounds. And the words in the list are as follows. You can have a look at them there. So the first example has been done for you, where we have neither and either. So the vowel sound there is the diphthong I. So a diphthong is whereby two vowel sounds join together to form a single vowel. An example we can have u and a brought together to form ua. Sound a, vowel sound a and a can also be brought together to form air, and so on and so forth. So in this case, the vowel sounds that we have in neither and either is the diphthong i. A look at uh, the jumble words here some of the words that can be clustered together based on the similarity of their vowel sounds we can have juice and cruise juice and cruise we have the long vowel sound u in both of them again we have a belt 
and guilt sound e we have another cluster leopard and jeopardy jeopardy and leopard the vowel sound a then we also have guide and guys the diphthong i in both the words then lastly we can also have electricity and 11 the sound e that comes at the beginning of both words the last one we are expected to give another word that is pronounced the same way as the following and that question expects us to provide the various homophones for the words there there is the beach with the spelling as you can see b e a c h so a word that is being pronounced the same as that is beach but in this case with double e we also have the word bean which is spelled as b double e n and that is being pronounced the same as bean which is a uh, crop b e a n then lastly we have the word there loan 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 which most of us may refer to as loan but it is being read as loan and uh, it is being as, uh, it, it is pronounced the same as loan which is someone uh, when someone is lonely yeah S soul or single so viewers that is uh, the end of our discussion uh, watch out for our videos until next time